Lee Baldwin is not a lush. Now, where do you get this wealth of misinformation? Well, I have certain people that uh, find out things for me. Don't bring them around me, ever. But they're looking out for your best interests. Oh, yeah? What, by trying to make a fool out of me in this campaign? No, by trying to help you win your campaign. I will win this campaign or lose it on my own merits. I don't play dirty pool. All is fair during a political campaign. Not in this one. Fine. But do you think you're being fair to the people of Fort Charles? What do you mean? Well, think about it. Why does a person drink to escape reality? As far as I know, Lee Baldwin deals with reality just fine. Oh, sure. But what happens if he's elected mayor? The responsibilities pile up, the pressure really gets on him. So what happens? He goes to the bottle and the whole city goes down the river. Man, you're crazy. He's a very responsible man. I know. I read it in the paper. But you ought to think about it. About what? Until yesterday, you were the fair-haired boy. Now he's thrown his hat into the ring and you could be shoved aside. If that's what the people want, that's what they want. You're not going to let the people of Port Charles take a chance on a drunk? You're walking a real thin line with me, Neil. The man was arrested for drunken driving. He's bungled several law cases. His past life was a mess. Okay, that's the past. What does that have to do with now? The paper makes him out to be Mr. Clean. It is up to you. It is your duty to inform the people of the truth. You want to know the truth? I'll tell you the truth. I don't judge people on their past histories. And I certainly don't want to be judged on my past history. You want to start that game? I mean, I got some situations in my past we certainly don't want to deal with. Now look, those people are going to deal with this campaign on the issues of the moment. And that's all I have to say with them. Wait. No, look, this discussion is over. I thought you liked to win. Yeah, I want to win, man. Sure I do, but I'm not going to win playing it that way. Well, uh, I tell you, you're not going to get to the top uh, in the real world then. Maybe it's about time somebody changed those rules to you. I think it's about time you learned something about winning. Maybe so. But whether I win this office or not, I'm playing it my way. Straight, clean, and upfront. Now this discussion is over. Finito. Okay, finito. Okay, just take your seat and we'll talk about something else, all right? Just just sit down for a minute. Today's you better, schedule. You better make sure it's something else. Hey, it's today's schedule. Just come on, have a seat. We got a we got an appointment. Oh, it's in fifteen minutes or so with the printer. Yeah, the campaign posters. That's right. We've got the proofs. And we have to decide right now what, uh, which one we're going to go with. Yeah, well, what about the morning coffee with the senior citizens? No, that's all set. That's all set. And after that, we have this press lunch with Baldwin. Right all here. right. If possible, I would like to squeeze in some therapy with Natalie before it. Uh, something wrong with your legs? No, I just want to make sure I'm ready to run. <laughs>